Hello, it's Harry from Excel Render. I put this video together to highlight the benefits of using our Render Defender Sealer, which has been specifically designed for Monocouche renders. This sample panel is a Monocouche render manufactured by Parex. Parex are a very well known and trusted manufacturer. They're very popular on the new builds, as well as commercial and domestic renovation works. I will just say that the Render Defender will work on any Monocouche render, whether it be Weber, KRN, VBI, etc. etc. So what I've done on this sample panel is I've sealed half of it and left the other half unsealed. So when I'm running the hose over it, you'll see one side is like water off a duck's back, which is absolutely class. That's exactly how you want it. You don't want any moisture getting drawn into the render at all. But you'll see the other side, which is unsealed, it's sucking the water in like a big sponge, which is just going to cause loads of problems down the line. Green, black and red algaes love moisture. They also love render. So when you combine the two, you're creating a breeding ground for the grown fester. Not only will it look hideous, the render will decay, causing it to rot. The winter freeze and fall cycle will erode the saturated render, which will eventually cause the render to crack and fall off the wall. The installation of the render defender will keep the render bone dry. This in turn will stop algae growth. So this next clip, it looks a bit more like a horror film. It's not actually meant to, but uh, it looks like we're interrogating the sample panel or something here. Looks a bit dodgy to me, but yeah, what I've done was got some wet compost, uh, push it all into the render sample, scrubbed it around, and I let it dry for about five days, let it go hard, let it set on the render. And then what I've done is got the hose, try to squirt all the loose render off, and uh, well, you'll see what happens. Yeah, so you'll see on the top where the render had the render defender applied to it. The render, the dirt, sorry, came off it quite easily with a hose pipe. On the bottom, it was just left unprotected with nothing on it. Was, it's exactly the same sample panel, actually, what I used in the first clip. But uh, yeah, you'll see it's a lot. It doesn't, doesn't, it's a lot more stubborn on the bottom half. The dirt doesn't want to come off as easily it does on the top. So that just gives you a, a better idea of uh, what the render defender can do. Like I say, it's good gear. Worth having on your render, keeping your walls nice and dry, cleaner for longer, and it just saves a lot of money down the line. Where it saves your render falling off the walls. So that's all from me for now. Hope that gives you a better idea of what the render fender can do and how it can benefit your walls. Um, if you want to get in touch, book make a booking or just ask any general questions. Get in touch on the website, Facebook, Instagram, or just give us a call or text. That's all for now. Goodbye.